new build everyone. In this one we're going to be drilling out all the windows and for the navigational lighting plus paint touch-ups. Okay, before I actually start any of the windows here, I'm gonna paint the phaser strips on on all the, the model parts here. Get that all done first, and then I'm gonna start on the windows. Now the point here where I'm going along here, I hold my breath. That way I can get a reasonably clear line, nice and clean, and then I do the same thing on the opposite side of the phaser strip. There we have it. Okay, so these two are done. The primary source is done. Just going to finish off with the rest of that. Um, now, ultimately, to really be professional about it, you would have masked off the hulls here and just spray the strip. But I just wasn't willing to put in that extra time because I want this model built. Okay, I got those done as well. Yeah, I've been doing some more painting here, and I got colors here that are pretty darn close to the hull colors. A little bit different still, but it just gives it character here. Looks good. Kind of hard to see with this kind of light, but. And uh, I redid these sections here where all the 
the new holes are going to be. Look at that, almost blends right in. You can hardly see it now, which is good. And redid the bridge here as well. Just got to let this dry and then we can start drilling. Well guys, got myself a brand new Dremel here, so uh, let's get back to drilling. I'm going to pick up where I left off here, just work my way around. I'm going to do every other window on both sides and throughout the rest of the model. There we go. Looks good. Now I didn't bother with any of the windows that's close to the center of the ship here because I'm going to be building a separate uh, a piece to go over top here uh, similar to what I did for the Nebula class. It's going to be a little bit wider though. Um, so yeah this is all ready to go here for this. Now what I did with the windows here I followed the angle of the hull as I drilled so basically I started here and then drilled more or less almost directly sideways for these bottom windows here just so the light can come out uh, better um, if you went and drilled them down like this when you put the two halves together it would pretty much close them all off so you have to drill them in sideways like that so that one's done and I just got to do the bottom half of the engineering hull get that done and then the two halves of the saucer there we go okay got those two halves done just gotta worry about the saucer sections now It's coming along and as before is the engineering hall yeah just following the hall here and the further away from the main lighting which is going to be in this area here the steeper the angle you want to drill on 
till you're almost horizontal down here. Almost. And just got to do that all the way around. There we go. All but done. It only took uh, about, uh, mm, I don't know, two and a half hours. <laughs> um, now, for the bay windows in the back here, I'm going to use a slightly smaller bit. Just drill them out and then I'll use the X-Acto knife to corner it off because the windows in here are square and rectangular. Uh, the windows sections up in here and along the front here, I will use the same smaller bit. Not, not hugely tiny, just one uh, step smaller than the bit I use on these windows. And then this section here is all done. And then I just have to do that one. There we go, got that done, got these areas hill here done, so, perfect. We even got the bridge section here done now, looks good. Okay, now I'm going to start drilling out these bay windows in here. Uh, I got. I using the slightly smaller bit that I would use for these windows, um, just because these are so close together. I don't want to risk uh, ruining that. Okay, so I'm gonna start with this first, and then do the outer ring here after.
Okay, now I got all of these done. Got to do the outside here. Now I'm not going to drill at these here uh, for the navigational deflector here for the saucer section. Um, I'm going to be putting in a completely different structure along the nose section here, which will go down into this area. Um, but uh, I'm, I'm still in the process of figuring out what I'm going to make it look like. So for now, I'm just going to get the outer edges here done on these windows, and then all the windows are then finished. There we go. Looks good. All right. They're all done. Windows are done. Well, folks, that's it for this episode. In the next one, we're going to start working on the additions to the ship. So please like, subscribe, comment, don't forget to share, and check out my online store. The link is down below. If you have any questions or you want me to do some commission work for you, Contact me at modelbuilder501 at yahoo.ca. I'll see you all again later. Bye-bye.